Hey guys, what's up and welcome to this week's video. So since I am quarantined right now, not quarantined, I'm self-isolating. I don't have corona. I figured I'm bored and I love makeup, so why not do a fun little springtime makeup look? I don't have a lot of makeup here though, so here's the catch. This is my makeup table, which there's actually a lot of makeup here and in this bag. But the catch is, this is makeup I don't really use all the time. Some of it's actually really kind of old. And I have a little bit in here. All my good makeup is in New York in my apartment. So we're going to see if we can put a look together with what's sitting in here. Ready? Look, I'm such a good sister I got and I had this cute little present from Poland. <laughs> Isn't that so cute? <laughs> Is so cute? So cute. I'm the best sister ever. Part of my tripod is missing, so I'm balancing my camera on my tripod and we're gonna hope that this doesn't fall. Right off the bat, I don't have any foundation, but I do have some leftover concealer, so. Let's see how we can make this work. Okay, we're gonna do the eyes next. So this is a MAC paint. These are actually really cool. I don't know what happened to them, but you actually get so much product in here and you just need the tiniest, tiniest little bit. You can put this all over your eye. I want to keep it like fun and springy. Maybe let's go with this. Eyes are glittery. Okay, and then I'm gonna just take this and I'm gonna use this like top color. Don't even have a brush, so I'm just gonna kind of apply it like under my brow bone for like a little bit of a highlight here. And I'm probably making a mess. So that's great. And while I'm at it, I'm just gonna do my brows. This is whatever's left of a brow pencil, Ofra. It says universal, but this color actually doesn't do much to my brows. This keeps it really light, so I think what I wanna do is take some mascara, and I'm gonna take off like 95% of the product. I've already messed up. This was a terrible idea. I'm gonna quickly blend this out. This is why I never use black in my brows. I always use a dark brown. Black comes across, even though my eyebrows are black, I just find it comes across way too aggressive. So I also don't really have eyeliner, so I'm going to take this pencil, rub it into my lash line. Now that I think of it, I should have used this first in my brows because it's dark brown, but I wasn't thinking, so... And I'm just going to take a clean finger. They actually have a smudger on this side, but I like using my finger and just the warmth to blend it out. Okay, and then I'm going to take the same pencil and put it in my lower lash line. And I'm going to add some inner corner highlight, but I can't really look and do it. So I'm going to do that and come right back. So I just added some inner corner highlight and just used this one. It's the liquid metal from... Catrice. It's actually so beautiful. Okay, so next I want to try this elf stick. It's supposed to be like a multi-purpose stick that you can use on your eyes and your lips and your cheeks. So kind of want to put this on as a blush and hopefully I don't regret it. So This is the Bobbi Brown Rose Lips and Cheeks blush. We're gonna use this because I actually really like this and this is in the shade Rose 10. Okay, so next I'm gonna do mascara. Okay, I forgot to record this part, but I put on some mascara already. I'm just taking that Bobbi Brown Cream Lip and Cheek product and putting it on my lips. And that's it for my look. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!